To me, uh, this arena is the first building built in our second century, and I think it's a really great testament to the success of the institution and what we're hoping to be for the next 100 years in a place for the community to be and for us to watch a Division I hockey program uh, right here on campus. I think what's unique about this uh, arena, and as you look around and you see the width of the concourse, it's all about making sure that the people that come here connect with each other and see each other. We hope that our alumni will be coming to campus and they will come in the lobby and see someone they hadn't seen in a couple of years and they'll go upstairs and see somebody else. The Cube, I think, is one of the highlights of this building. It's an entire glass enclosed function room standing right uh, on Beaver Street, feeling almost like you're floating over Beaver Street. This is the upper level lobby. So in here will be a double staircase that will lead people coming into the arena up and onto this upper concourse. This lobby will have a seating area as well and a gathering spot. It'll be where we recognize donors on the donor wall. Both floors are designed to be a congregation space and a place for people to hang out. It's all about making those kinds of connections uh, designed specifically to do that. We're very proud of the efforts we've put into making this uh, a lead building. We have designed it to a lead platinum standard. But the whole planning process uh, with Amanda King, our Director of Sustainability at Bentley, was to make this the most efficient building possible and to make it a really smart business endeavor. First of all, I thank all of our alums as they watch the growth of this university. Again, I'm going to be extremely proud and I think it's a place that's going to be more of a gathering spot, more of a place for people to come back to because of the things that it's planned to be used for. So it's a tremendous addition, I think, for the university overall.